Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and welcome to episode 2 of Direwolf20's Forgecraft 2 series. Look at me, I just discovered that it's not actually season 8 already. I was, I thought it was, but you know what, I was looking at the season number for my Let's Play series, and like, it just didn't occur to me that I was actually on season 6 of Forgecraft, not 8. So, the next season for Let's Play, single player, would be 8, but nope, we're only on 6, so... Dire Derp last episode. I know you guys probably made a lot of comments about that, but that's okay. So I am getting ready to start with the Tinker system. So I've got a few things ready to go here. I kind of want to get this smeltery up and running like right away because uh, I feel like that would be like the best purpose for me to do right now. So let's get a smeltery going because I definitely want to see what's involved here. So first things first, let's get a drain and a casting table and all that stuff. So casting table, absolutely. Uh, we'll also want maybe a basin, but not yet. Let's get a drain. We'll probably want, oh, I got my book for that, cool. Um, ooh, what is the recipe for the controller? I think it's just this, right? Yes. And a tank, smeltery tank. Let's see what that is. I know it's something in there. I think it has glass in it. Uh, smeltery tank is just glass in the middle. All right, I should be able to pull that off. I should have some sand. Let's get eight of them cooked up at once and just throw that in here. So while I'm waiting for that, I'm definitely going to want one of those and then we can get started. So we're gonna do the controller. Here's where we'll have some stuff. Uh, I'm going to want the drain here, but not in that direction. There we go. Put this thing. And underneath that is where I'll put the casting table. And then clearly we're going to want a good number of these things. And then one more plus the drain should get us the most basic, not necessarily the most basic, but you know what I mean, a pretty basic uh, setup. So we'll do that, and we're lit, cool. So the next thing we're gonna wanna do is I'm gonna actually steal this, and you know what, you can keep going, because I'm not quite ready yet. I had prepped my clay, but whoops, dire derped. Let's bring in TeamSpeak. Sound resumed. Uh, hey everybody, so I'm recording, so you know. Okay. Set. I'm uh, making my bucket. You're making uh, yes. your bucket? Yeah, I'm firing a bucket. Ah, right, okay. Good so I have a question now. Mm -hmm. um, like, how do I get a, a mold if I can't mine any metals? Because you can mine still make copper. stone items, you just can't use them. Right, but how do I make the mold? Like, don't I have to melt down either gold or what no. is it? Aluminum. Oh, you can make aluminum brass because you can mine both aluminum and copper. Okay, so I have to find aluminum then. Yes. Yeah. I think it can be a bit of a pain. Oh, I'm sure. Let's see. I've got plenty of copper, so that's good. So let's see. What's the ratio? It took me a while to find aluminum last night. Yeah. Um, so it's three I... aluminum to one copper, right? Right, yes. So I'm probably going to want to get like. I'll put two copper in there for now, but I have to get some uh, stuff first. So I can mine aluminum then. That's good to know. I haven't found any yet, but I'm off to look. Dun dun. On the hunt for aluminum. Yell if you see it. The good news is that uh, there's like a ravine right underneath my base. Oh, wow. Yeah, so I happened to find that while I was digging downwards. So I found lava. I, I got lucky in that. Well, not lucky, but I ended up using bushes to get my aluminum rather than the ore. Oh, yeah? I think I just found yeah. some aluminum. Ah, well, that's sort of Yeah. I hate taken you. care of. Like, I, I just hate you now. Thank you. I that aim to me, anger slowpoke. That that just took me like the amount of time last night that took me. What and finding just, aluminum? Like yeah, it can like, be rare, but it, it's never been that rare that it's like brutal. 
These guys will tell you, both me and Tark had a hard time finding it. Yeah? I can kind yeah. of believe that. I think it's because you were looking for it along with Tog, and he's pretty unlucky. This might be true. Yeah. Although we're, we're in different places of the world. So. Oh, Tog, I just got plus one luck on my... Play. I got fortune one on my pick. A, uh, a block. block. Wow, already? Yeah, like I just a got another upgrade light. and it was, yeah. it was awesome. Wow, that's nuts. Yeah. Well, I've been mining, you know, a lot with my pick, so... And I get to keep these upgrades when I replace the head, right? Yeah, you do. I, I mean, I, I'm loving mine. I've got like reinforced four, haste, look, auto repair two, durability wow. fifty percent, and durability plus five hundred. That's bonuses That's cool. so far. Yeah, it's kind of awesome, isn't it? Like, I love this mod. It's definitely fun, I, and I'm not even kidding. Like. You know the first time you played Thongcraft and you're like, I just want to scan all the things? Mm. Like, right now, I just want to mine and see, like, what free upgrades I get from mining. Like, I've played with Iguana Tweaks in mod packs before, clearly, but I've never, like, played in, like, a normal... A normal world. Yeah. Yeah. And it's interesting, isn't it? Because the first tool you make could be the last tool you make. Yeah, it could be. Which is kind of cool. And that yeah, is first... something that I like, because yeah. I always felt like with with a lot of the other mods and with um like the original vanilla um tinkers that like a lot of the time you wound up just like gunning for the best you. it's kind of cool yeah it is cool i like that and it would definitely like make me cry if i lost it heal people yeah if I lose it, it's going to be because of Soren. He'll probably kill me, and then I'll be, like, murdering him. I think the only real way to lose is, like, burning lava or something like that. Yep. Uh, I, one I, sec. I no, no. That it's like, it'll survive dropping into the lava. Um, if you can't go and physically get it, then, yeah. Um, how is TeamSpeak volume low? I don't know. It's, like, maxed out. I don't know. We're probably all yeah, trolling yeah. you and just whispering. How's this? Oh, this? I just put it in here. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, I think so. Is everybody having awesome. trouble hearing Diewolf on TeamSpeak? That seems really strange. I have logic and calculation already. Okay, so you need uh, silicon and uh, engineering? Yeah. Oh, you guys are working on uh, AE already? Uh, it's engineering. Yeah. Wow. Where did the silicon one go? I didn't get it. Uh... Maybe this will be the season that I automate Orberry Bushes. <laughs> I keep saying I'm going to do it, and then I never get around to it, just because like it's really not even that necessary. Ooh, I found Essenceberry Bushes. That's ideal. You need another silicon? Yeah. You need any others, Prog? I need the other two. Okay, so logic. logic. And calculation. calculation. Thanks, Tyler. Yeah. Okay. logic. So we have an alamite head. Let's see if we can repair this. Yes. And we can go to the never and get all scared. I seem to have found somebody here. else's area because there's like a cobblestone wall in front of me. Uh, at what coordinates? I have grandmastered the dire pick one. This is better than the stuff that Rafi's tools keep coming out with. Hello. 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 Show me your loud voices. Jaden. Yes. I'm recording just so you know. I'm drawing Hi, just Jayden. so you know. Fair enough. <laughs> I'll try and remember, but I have really nasty head cold. Oh, that's not good. Just oh boy, there I am. I got lost for then, a minute. Then, then again, drugged jaded just really means happy jaded. I feel <laughs> Maybe we should keep me away from the slope up. He tends to ruin that. Oh, thanks very much. <laughs> what? Love you too. <coughs> 
All right, I wouldn't um, mine more aluminum, but I think I've got enough at least to get started with what I need to do. This zombie is holding an iron ingot. I was what the told heck? there was a Cleetho. Mm -hmm. She's here, but I think she's uh, muted. I'm gonna go yell at her. Yeah, do that. I've been trying. She hasn't been listening. Not nice. He's my girlfriend. She has to pay attention to me. <laughs> All right, guys, so sure I am off to smelt some aluminum brass so I can get, hopefully, a better pickaxe. So first things first, you, you, and you. Right, let's have a look. Uh, uh, uh. While I'm doing that, I can probably make myself another chest. That was really random. Or two, oh, or wow, four. I got lucky. Yeah, maybe. I spawned right ne next to a Never Fortress. Hey. Really? Yeah, literally right on top of one. Nice. Yeah, the, I, the uh, path from your portal goes to my other portal. What? You, you had dug out a three by three tunnel, right? No. No. Not me. I've no. literally only just come here, so... Oh, you hadn't gone through your other ah. portal before? Cle Cletho says the same thing um, that I generally say, is that this specific room just has way too many people in it talking to stream it. Oh. Why did she join the room? Well, because she wanted to be sociable. Yeah. She wanted to be sociable, Jeez. but she didn't, she didn't realize how many people were going to be talking over her here. It is she challenging. Such a quiet little yeah. Thing. Me, I'm, I'm dire, sorry. slow, did you, I'm sorry. Did you see quiet and Cleetho in the same sentence? Hello. He doesn't push quite as hard as you or I would. I just had a crash. Oh, there's Cleetho. Oh. Hi, Clee. Hello. Hey. Hey, Clee. I, I, I was explaining why you left us. <laughs> no, don't, don't, don't worry, Clee. I, I frequently only pop in here for short term and then... Go to my room or a smaller room because it's too big. What Multiple do you mean you yes. are not doing chat? Nice. Oh, you I understand. I'm just not talking over everybody. Put a little bit more copper in there Actually, and then we can mine some good stuff. <laughs> if you there talk to me and I don't respond, just remind me that I have to push the button. Cleefa? Hey, Cleefa, <laughs> remember you have to push the button. Push the button. Shush you. <laughs> Okay. Well, Mysterious, Mysterious now he's got to cut. Um, well, hey, it's a CBW. At least, at least that one's one you can probably manage to cut out without it sounding too bad on the resulting YouTube video. Probably. No so chat. I'm going to replace the pickaxe head. Let's see. The so my pickaxe has to be fully repaired, yeah, right? Yes. And then... Yeah. You can't replace the, parts the... without it being fully repaired. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. And it keeps all the upgrades the and the jeans. levels and everything. I like that a lot. Do you what, Marathi? I made the pretty. I, I, I think no, I, I think the going to like it. in there right now. He mutilated some great rule of space. All right, I'm also getting iron. Definition of, like... You guys are so weird. Why so do I there's... hang out with you guys? Nobody's ever quite sure. Because... So what's the next material I should make my pickaxe head out of after iron? Bronze. Bronze is the next one? Yeah, tin and copper. Okay. But, uh... Oh, that's lead. That's why I can't mine it. I was going to say, I can't mine oh, so it's lead. Did, 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 is Klee on, on Forgecraft now? Did we get our Klee? Yes. Yes. No, she's on FC2. She's playing it. <laughs> she's streaming it. Jeez. Ow. All right, guys. I'm going to come back in a minute. Oh, I wonder if poor ores are, like, smart about copper. They're a thing. They are a thing. But now they still need to harvest level 10. Boo. Okay. Yes. I'm going to mine for a little bit, get some resources, and then we'll come back and maybe make a bronze pickaxe head. See you guys Stop in a few minutes. Stop trying to cheat, you cheater. All right, guys. I'm back. Everybody lied to me. Um, wait. No, but I, I have a... Let, let, can I please take a look at the configs before you go doing that, Dyer? Because that doesn't actually sound like the way the mod works unless okay. they added 
the custom. They did add some the custom. Um, can I please take a look? I'm gonna at trust Jaded. I'm loaded. Sure. Because Jaded knows things the... and Slowpoke knows nothing. This is true. <laughs> well, no, it's more like. It, it's not that. It's like, um... No, no, it's I that. I've had a lot of help with the development of this. Yeah. So I'm a little startled to hear somebody managed to make it do that. Yeah, so sure like, possible. I just want to know if I should put an iron pickaxe head on here or not. Well, that's what we've all done, though. Yeah, I've been mining, like, I've repaired I'm it three times. Uh, Sorry? Flo, do you have a, um, the, the, the config for I don't know if it's the right just one. Just drop in Dropbox? I'll have a look. Because I've got to wait for C file to sync. I apparently haven't logged in in a while. Which config will it be? Will it be the Tinker's one? Or will it be It'll the... be the Iguana Tinker Tweets. The IGW mod? Oh. So I gather what I want to do then. It's a folder, slow. Alright, got it. Yeah, just dip that on yeah. Dropbox, let me. Let's do this. And then we'll see which one sinks fastest, you know? Sweet. Uh, right. Which Forgecraft is it? Two. So let's put this here and pour iron into it. Yeah, I do kind of like the concept. I'm just making the iron pickaxe anyway because I have iron and I'm tired of waiting. Jade, but CBW I will be interested to, to hear what you find out, Jade. Channel. Sweet. I have mining level 10. Look at that. Is he? That brain hurts. Brain hurts. Yeah. Yeah, I, I realize it has the crazy levels from ME4, CBW. It's that um, based on what I was told about how the leveling could be done, you couldn't do that where one head type wouldn't level up. You either had mining levels on or you had them off for all heads. No. All oh, right. Okay. I see what you're saying, Jude. It's not off at the beginning. So if one head levels up, all heads should. What you could change the last time I fiddled with it, and from what I understood from the devs, was you could determine how much um, experience each of the heads needed to get that extra mining level. Ooh, I just got plus 100 lapis. Nice. I I am liking the upgrading thing. That's pretty cool. All right, so I think I need more tin then, because I've only got two tin. Let's see how much bronze costs to smelt. David? Huh? Can you go into... See Mankini Mansion right above us? Oh, 110, 3 you right click on that... 1103 copper. I can do that. Okay, why? Open up the file browser. We'll be back in a minute, guys. Ah. Alright, guys, I threw copper and tin in here and I've got bronze. So, Jaded found out for us that every other level, is that right, Jaded? You'll get a plus one mining level? Yeah. With our current. Every odd level. Cool. Alright, now I have, to, <laughs> I have to put an iron ingot on here so that I can repair it. And each, each head can only go up one mining level above its base. So, like, you can't take a copper and level it all the way to diamond. That won't work. Right. It's only one Doesn't level happen. up. That much I figured out. I just wasn't sure if it would level, like, if, if you could only ever do it once. Like, you know, it was a flint pick and it leveled up once. Now I'm done ever getting more levels or not. But this way is just faster because I don't have to wait for it to level up like that. And hi, Morvi. Hello. How's it going? Pretty good. Hey, so that's Bobby. got mining level redstone. Sweet. Every time I poke my head out the door, it's not nighttime. Is that a, is that a new voice I hear? It's a Clee. It's Clee, though. Hi, Clee. Not at all. <laughs> no, it's not really new. I saw you at Pax out. But I am going to go and restart my computer because something really weird is going on. Okay. I am going to mine some more. I think I can mine gold now. That might be true. I can mine all the things. Sort of. Who's like, streaming at the moment? 
I guess the only level after redstone, I guess, is diamond and then gold, right? No, I think diamond is the same as redstone. Is it? But there's... Well, I mean, no, like, to be able to get obsidian, right? The nether... What? Obsidian is a level, right? Yeah. Yeah, I can mine gold. Woot. All right, guys, we'll be back after I do just a bit of mining. I think that pretty much covers most of Iguana Tweak, so at least, you know, to get started. And luckily I don't have to do all that stuff with uh, other things, but maybe I'll do some of it with the sword. I don't think much else is necessary, like a shovel or anything. So does it, is it does, by the way, before I wrap up the segment, does Iguana Tweaks work well now with, um, like, the longbows and such? Yeah. Because uh, in ME4 it wasn't behaving there very does... well. Well, there does seem to be, like, I could swear you guys have some other mods on there other than just thermal expansion that adds ranged weaponry. Yeah, there's a bunch of different types of ranged weaponry in Yimmy Hot Cubed. Well, no, um, the Iguana Tinker's Tweaks allows you to specify, um, what tools, um, are ignored by the mod. Yeah, I saw that. And the only one that's in there is thermal expansion. Gotcha. Now, there was a few others that were, like, in there by default, unless somebody changed it. Yeah, there's some sword ones. Batania's in there, I think, for example. Oh, good, I got Ferrosaur. That's a good thing to get. Oh my goodness, is somebody building a castle in the village already? Uh, maybe. Alright, guys. What do you I expect from Hes? Okay. All right, we're back, guys. All right. So, yeah, I mined a whole bunch of stuff. I even found redstone. Guess what I found out? What? Certus Quartz requires obsidian mining level. Yes. You, you can actually yeah. change what the different things require. I don't actually mind. I'll probably get obsidian pretty quickly at this point. Because I'm guessing, obsidian like, easy. the next level after redstone is obsidian, right? It is, yes. Alright, so it should I like auto operate my, my head thing. On and I'm good out. Yeah. So how am I in here for iron? I've got two ingots of iron. I need five iron ingots right now. Actually, can you even This is the newest version of Iguana Tweaks, right? That I don't know the answer to. Oh, I already have iron. Hopefully. Hopefully. Yes it is, Jaded. Fast where it is, yes. There's a sheep here with a panda hat, it looks ridiculous. <laughs> wonder if I have a dev version then. There's a couple things right, that's that are missing. So, I don't know. Oh. But, um, a couple of things you were saying seemed uh, slightly out of whack with what uh, I've been doing. Never got an extra level on a pick after the first. Oh. <laughs> Accidentally made two watering cans. Anybody want a watering can? <laughs> sure. All right, come find me, Morby. What, what, where am I finding you at? I'm right near spawn, like west of spawn, and you can't miss it. It's a big hole with cobblestone cool. near it. Well, I, I, I will be by if I can go back to spawn. Oh, good. We have that mod that lets you right-click plants. So looks like does the agricraft stuff not respond to a watering can? Probably not. If it's based on IC2 crops, it won't. Um, it I think they, it has a special behavior for um, watering cans. Gotcha. Because, like, the wheat that I planted is doing great, and the carrots and potatoes, like, they haven't grown at all. Do they need a special soil or something? Uh, crop stairs? Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not familiar with Agricraft at all. It's a really cool mob. Is it? Yeah, but like. Yeah, you can use a seed analyzer to tell what mutations you've gotten. That's cool. Now, like, uh, my I'm, main question I'm is: Is there a benefit to like packs. teching up in it? Like, if you get to like a top tier seed, is it gonna like fill your hunger bar on one bite, or like give you potion effects or something? Um, on Forgecraft, no. Okay. Nobody did enough tweaking to the configs. Um, gotcha. In uh, if, if somebody tweaks through it uh, you can get a whole lot of different tiers and levels and etc okay 
but default when it just stuck in with harvest craft it combined all of the various different things kind of at random um to make a uh, mutation gotcha and then you can like scan things in a seed analyzer to find out um stuff come on plants grow yeah like i let them sit all night you know, right like an actual general night and they didn't grow at all so i don't know yeah Carl not like i planted them a while ago and they're definitely mind. not growing like just no, on farm w, if, if, if the tools aren't taking that giving you that second level up there should be when you look at a tool um did you guys toss on uh Tecon tooltips? Yes, we did. Yeah. Okay, well, when you look at the tool, there should be two experience bars. One should be level, and one should be, like, XP or something like that. I forget which. They, they make, it makes no sense why there's two until um, you realize that there's actually a mining level level up, and there's a modifier level level up, and they're separate. That's enough wheat for now. Uh, it says mining XP boot. Yeah, it is. Uh -huh. I'm, I'm looking at it right now when there's only one. There's a yeah, skill I'm, I'm... XP, and that's it. Skill XP... Well, wait, but CPW just said you have a mining boost. Yeah, well, it's... All right, so what I'm seeing is mining level R date. Are you mining... seeing No, No, but I'm going to be in a second. The mining XP says boosted rather than a number. Did you find my base, by the way, Morby? Thanks for me, and I think that's, I think that's what I was saying. Uh, is that uh, it boosts it uh, once for a particular pick. And I've changed this head about four times now, and it's never gone away. Uh, I think it, it gets that boost once, and then it's perma-boosted, as far as I can tell. It doesn't go away or come back again. That's a bug. Ooh, if, okay. if it's doing what you're saying it's doing, that's a bug. Because what it's supposed to do is... Um, so I go in with my flint pick, and this is how it worked in 164 in Agrarian Skies and Magic Farm, etc. And I mine with it. That flint levels up, and I get a modifier. Then the flint levels up again, and I get a mining skill level boost, which takes it to copper. At this point, I can mine everything except actually copper ore. Then I have to put a copper one on it and go through the process again. I get one modifier and one mining skill level. All right, guys. We'll be back in a minute. Which it. All right, guys, we're back. I did a little bit of mining. I brought some um, iron with me and stupidly forgot that I already upgraded this thing to bronze. So I don't have a way to repair my pick at the moment, but that's okay. I'm going to go get some bronze. I should have some in the smeltery. Let's see if I'm right about that. So I'm going to put away all the goodies that I collected here. Clearly just a bit of mining. I'm going to show you guys where I was uh, doing it. So hopefully I get some diamonds soon. What, what am I for bronze? Three ingots. Cool. So I haven't yet got an automatic upgrade on my pick yet, but working on it. Let's see. There we go. Nice. So I did get reinforced three. Nice. That's awesome. That was one of the upgrades I got from... I've gotten a couple upgrades, but I still haven't gotten the one where I can mine better. So I'm still kind of hoping slash working towards that. Um, at least hopefully I should be able to mine diamonds. So if I don't get the upgrade automatically, once I find diamonds, then I should be able to get the obsidian level of mining. So you can see I've just been kind of mining through here. This is about as far as I got before I ran out. So diamonds, and I'm at Y level eight, so hopefully I can find diamonds here. Ooh, dense redstone, always love when that happens. So yeah, I'm feeling like Iguana Tweaks is kind of fun to play with. It, it really kind of changes the way mining works a little bit because it it kind of encourages you to work towards leveling up your pick rather than just you know crafting the best thing and being done i think it just makes it a little bit more fun i'm liking it i like iguana tweaks i think it's cool maybe you'll even see it in a future dial 20 pack who knows maybe not to 1.8 though i think it's a little bit late to add such a game-changing mod to the 1.7 pack so if i do add it it won't be till 1.8 it's all good 
So I think what I'm going to do, guys, is probably just do a bit of mining uh, between this episode and next, and then we'll come back next episode. Soren will probably be here, and then we can probably work towards getting, you know, a bit more situated with everything in the world. Uh, I'll also probably water some plants and try and get myself some more food. All right, for now, Direwolf20 signing off. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. Like I said, we'll be back next time and should maybe even build a base because that's usually what Soren's job is, and he'll probably be back then. All right, guys. Take it easy.